Aries, this is your reading for June of 2022. We are on fire. We got to talk about this, right? So we've got the Eight of Swords, the Six of Cups, the Temperance, and then we have the Challenge as the Page of Pentacles, and we have the Outcome as the Nine of Swords. So I am going to tell you here that you're feeling a little bit tight. You're feeling a little bit on fire. Um, and not in a good way. You can see that he's stuck, he's tied, and there's some fire behind him, and who the hell knows what's coming. Take a deep breath in for me, okay? Whatever you're struggling through, I feel as though you're going back. You're going back to old patterns, back to old ways. You can see you got kids and you got the grandparents in the back. This, to me, intuitively is telling me that you're, you're kind of feel like you've made a stride, and now you're doubting everything and moving backwards. So it's time to let that go because you've got the temperance card, which is balance. So lower the expectations, lower the things that are in your mind that is making you doubt yourself. Maybe you're not getting um, where you want to be. Maybe you're not making enough money. Maybe you're not finding the love that you want. Let those thoughts go and follow your heart, follow the energy that you feel is the right direction, regardless of what you think the outcome is going to be. You've got the challenge card. So this is telling um challenge card. The challenge card is the page of pentacles. Pentacles are slow. They're slow moving. Okay? So it's not coming as fast as you want and that's what's making it you doubt yourself. The outcome here is the 9 of swords. So you can choose to feed the ego. You can choose, I call this an ego hole. It means you go down the hole and there's no stairs to get out. And it's like, think about it in a hole and you're scraping for the, the dirt, but all the dirt keeps crumbling every time you try to scrape. That is this. Look, right? Crying, disbelief, confusion, frustration. I'm gonna pull another card for you. We don't want that to be your outcome. So stop feeding the ego. Stop believing the ego. Stop believing all of those negative thoughts. There's a death card here. This is transformation for you. This is the universe putting you in this situation so that you get so freaking frustrated that you make a change. That you say, screw it, I'm not listening to this anymore. I have to listen to this. It's time for you to let go of what you're thinking and to just keep on the plan. Because you're gonna get there. Just keep moving.